A crow tried to peck and claw at a pair of young siblings near a wet market in Marine Parade on Sunday morning as their mother was making a grocery run. The bird attacked the boys, aged two and five, in an open-air space between 50 a Marine Terrace Market and Block 59 at around 11 a.m., said their mother, Miss Arifa Jawfa. The crow went for the boys' heads, but they were not injured, she said. She was at the market buying groceries with her five children, aged between 15 months and 8 years. When three of them encountered the crow outside the market, Miss Arifa, a 39-year-old grab delivery rider, told the Straits Times that the bird swooped in on her five-year-old first. It then turned to her two-year-old son and tried to strike his head with its beak and talons. The crow was aggressive. We tried to shoo it away, but it did not move away and still wanted to attack. She said. Miss Arifa added that the bird lunged at the younger boy two or three times. The boy was traumatized and cried during the attack, which lasted a few seconds, she said. Her seven-year-old daughter, who was with her two brothers in the open-air space at the time, was spared. Miss Arifa said that although she has been living in the area for seven to eight years, this is the first time she has witnessed a crow attack there. But it may not be the first to have occurred there. I heard from some people that one auntie was also suddenly attacked by a crow yesterday. She said. Miss Arifa said she usually goes to the Marine Terrace Market three or four times a week. Mr. Muhammad Adbala, 53, who sells cooked food at the food centre attached to the market, said he has noticed the number of crows in the area increasing over the years. There are a lot of crows near blocks 55 and 59 and also at the car park between blocks 51 and 52, he said. But he pointed out that the crows do not usually come for leftover food at the food centre, and it is usually the pigeons that do so. He said he has not witnessed any crow attack so far. Mr. Muhammad started his business at the food centre less than two months ago, but has been living in Marine Terrace for more than 10 years. Several cases of crows targeting people have been reported around Singapore this year such as in Orchard in October and in Bishan in February. These cases prompted the National Parks Board to remove crow's nests in those areas to prevent further attacks.